And to end this um, West Dream Odin Life Ball in the West video, I'm gonna episode. I'm going to give you a tour of uh, my scrub zoo, the zoo for this episode, zoo number nine. And this zoo will feature all sorts of different um, African adventure animals and some endangered species animals. Which, look at that, my zoo's all, zoo number nine is almost famous. So let's, so what are we waiting for? Let's get on with the tour. Let's giddy up, let's gallop all the way to the animals. Giddy up, horses. First animal I'm going to show you is, um, the, the aardvark. This aardvark has been living in a prairie, in the prairies for a long, long time. The scrub prairies. Oh, this aardvark needs some more ants. It's probably hungry. I think that's the sound an aardvark makes. Sounds like a pig almost. What's he digging for? Maybe, maybe some grub. More ants, ants under the ground. Those are good assumptions. And um, we got our secretary bird. Now, this secretary bird lives in a different prairie. Doesn't live in a scrub prairie. She lives in a grassland prairie. A grassland prairie in the U.S. Well, actually, she lives in Africa. Secretary birds are from Africa. Do you want? I want. I think she would like to kick ball with me. I don't think so. Wait, never mind. Whoa. She she took off. She took off like a rocket. I can't believe my mind. She's going for a run. Over here, I'm gonna. Sh here's the compost. Let's check on our compost. Oh, yeah, Make sure it's okay. Yeah. Nope. The compost is empty. Our zoo's pretty clean. The next animal I'll show you is um, the water buffalo. Here's the buffalo. Hey, African water buffalo, what's up? Where are you? Well, there he is. Well, there he is. What's up? What are you doing? Are you just sleeping? Oh, now you're moving. And then back up. Don't walk towards me. No, don't walk too close to me. I'm going to move far away. That buffalo. Coming up next is um this kind of monkey. It's a alpine monkey. Monkeys digging just like the aardvark did. It's called this monkey is called a gel gel gelan gelanda gel lada gelada. I'm going to call it gelada. What's gelada doing? Digging for something? Are you looking for um? For something to eat under the ground? Or did you lose one of your toys under the ground? Is that why you're digging? Wait, maybe you're, you're digging for more ants. I'm going to assume that um, animals that insectivores probably dig under the ground to find um, their prey. Look, a Skytram ride. And do you see that um, little girl um, 
up up there the smiley face she's excited she's thrilled she's so amused by that sky tower ride she had fun oh, I, I think I told you this before that we can't go on this it's too bad we can't go on the sky tram this video game did not uh, did not make a uh, make a make room for the did not make a scenery where we can go on this a program where we can go on the sky tram that's sad it, well it is what it is but we can still go on the sky tram ride sky tower that, that, this is that's a sky tower and this is the sky tower the sky tram is further away from us probably past that restaurant Yeehaw! Oh look, this is where the, the, the little cowgirls and boys can go for a little pony ride. And here's the funny part. Um, if I uh, jump up and down, you'll see the pony. But if I stay still on the ground and don't jump up, up and down, I won't be able to see the pony. Look, I'll show you an example. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! Here's our lovely meerkats. Have you seen these meerkats for the past, like, um, since episode 2? The meerkat's probably hungry. There is hungry. I think he's good for ants. Oh. Our container and sweep up its book. Oh, he won his own meerkat sent sentry post. Meerkats make use of their highly social nature to defend against larger predators when the the rest of the mob goes out to gather food. One meerkat acts as a sentry scanning the horizon to detect, detect put potential threats. Meerkats sentries often seek out high ground, climbing rocks, or even trees for a better view. Meerkats enjoy peeking out from the top of a meerkat sentry post, and they also use it as a shelter. I never do that. Oh, what's going on? I can hear guessing. Oh, hoo hoo ha, hoo hoo ha. Oh, looks like I got my 100 guests. I'm so proud. And this animal, if you already, if you haven't seen it before, is probably, um, it's called a rattle. A rat tail. It lives between Africa and Asia. And if you haven't seen one of these, have you ever seen this kind of animal before? If you lived in Africa and Asia? I'm eating, eating berries. Okay, good for me. I better go check check out what's going on there right now. Why everyone's acting. <gasps> the buffalo got out of his cage! The buffalo escaped from me. The bison, the bison! The bison escaped from his cage. What are you doing? How'd you get out of here? Hey, get back here. Get back here. No, going over the fence. No, you bad bison. Are you lost? Let's see if I can find the bison on the map. Are you not that pretty far? I think you're over, um... Bad bison. No, going over the fence. How do you get out in the first place? I'm gonna... Oh. He broke this fence! He broke this part of the fence! You naughty bison. Now I'm gonna have to put an iron fence around you. Now I'm gonna have to replace it with an iron fence. Has that ever happened to your pets? Did they, did they um, go, go somewhere you're not supposed to go? That's happened to me before. Dogs. 
can't believe he did that on an episode. One will advise me. No. No, you're sick. I'll take care of you right now. Feeling better? I guess you are. Well, let's check out some other animals. I, I bet you're probably waiting to see the kangaroo. The kangaroo is hiding here somewhere. Oh, there, th there, th there is the kangaroo. Do you know what the difference is between? Them? This is obviously um a male kangaroo. The male kangaroo is um is yellow, orangey yellow, and this is what the female kangaroo looks like, brown, big and brown, brownish red, got darker fur. is the main animal of the show. I'm going to be spending most of my time with the kangaroos. Hmm. She's thirsty. Well, I know what that means. I need to re repel replenish the metal food, food the metal food through with water. The container with water. is the striped hyena, if you probably all saw. What's that hyena doing? Hmm. That's interesting. Died from illnesses? Oh, that's too bad. I was gonna show you the koala. Now he's dead. Oh, well, how do I get out? Oh, thank you. How do I get out of here? Okay, I'm gonna turn left so we can see the African uh, spruce tortoise. She wants to get out of the shade and spend some time in the light. The heat lamp. Oh, it's very hot. It's hot then. Oh, I think I stepped on it. Hello, cute little turtle. Are you cute? And he lives in a, in a desert prairie too. I think you've seen a lot of tortoises out in the prairie, out in the desert, hot. Next in the alpine, next in alpine animal, it's the type of wolf. Right. What's the name of this wolf called again? A. An etho, an ethi, ethopian wolf, ethopian. It's a wolf that lives in the Alpha in a country called, in an African country called Ethiopia. But you can just call it Eth if you don't know how to pronounce the name of that country. Etha. Ethi. 
the ethical call an ethical. Where he lives? In a little burrow. I gotta replenish the food. Fish. Now I'm gonna be show showing you some animals up above. Let's go on the elevated path. From up here, from right here you can probably see the koala bears. The koala, not the koala. The koala. Oh yeah, I remember the koala died a long time ago. This is tragic. So. But don't worry, I'll go get a new koala. The animal store. There it is. Another koala. Look, there's actually two koalas in the zoo already. Oh, that koala is very sick. Oh no, she's died too. Oh, that was some. That was sad to see a koala die. Good thing it's. I placed another koala. I was about to stop her from getting sick and all of a sudden she died. That was an old sick koala. And uh, there are no animals in this exhibit. Unfortunately because I ran out of time to um, put an animal in that exhibit. And you've probably all seen the African Buffalo. And you, and you all know this is the staff center. This is where the staff go to get their supplies. Let's go check up, check up on a buffalo. Is the buffalo doing okay? I hope he promises not to go over the fence again because that really scared the audiences. Scared our guest, the zoo guest. My buffalo could have really killed all the animals. Killed him. Like our guest. And I'm not allowed to have killing. I don't want killing in my zoo. Or he could have gotten seriously injured. Somebody guessed. Hmm. Where animal is in here? The Komodo dragons. Where is that little Komodo dragon? Where are you, Komodo dragon? There he is! Are you going are you going for a little stroll? A little um um what what's he doing on? He's, look how he walks. He walks very funny. Interesting. Cool, isn't it? Angry Buffalo. Angry Buffalo. The blue food stalls over here. Where you remember, where you can all get um, water or, or soda. Oh, I need to erase these pillars. Water, soda, vegetables, sushi, and um, a, some submarine sandwiches. Next, I'm going to show you my lions. Mm -hmm. 
The African lions. This was the first animal I... First main uh, animal... Ah, uh, whatever. The king of all animals. King of all cats. Probably the second. Yeah. Oh, look! A baby lion! So cute. I'm very proud of you. I'm happy for you, lions. Having a cub. Two cubs. Is it a female or a male? The oldest. Usually line number three. This one. Line number four is a male. How cute. And, um, Giraffe M. What's that giraffe doing? Are we doing something? Ah, just going for it. A walk trip. Hey! Get out of the way, giraffe. Get off that road. No playing on the road. Okay, we're halfway done the tour. I'm going to show you the first half, now I'm going to show you the second. Second half of my Zoo Tycoon tour. We've got some other animals. The Barbray Ape. Our Barbara Ape. What's the Barbara Ape? Like he's standing there, uh, staring into. Maybe watching some imaginary TV. On the tree. Maybe this is. You know, like his TV over here. This tree's like his TV. A tr tree V. <laughs> yeah, tree V. Any guys ever heard? Whoa. -ho -ho. Look at those. There's a glitch in this game where. The benches disappear. Look, there's hardly any benches. But there's an invisible one right here. See, I can't um move any for forward because um there's a bench probably blocking it. The bongos? You guys remember the bongos? Wait, are you gonna eat the f the fence? Are you gonna eat the hedge fence? That's not it's not there for you to eat, it's it's there for you to it's there it's there to keep to protect you from other animals. It's there to keep you in. It's built to keep you in. Uh oh, there's a floating head. Things are getting weird around here. Seen. And next door, some kind of deer. Is it a gird? It's a gir It's a jern. Renuk. A jern. Jernuk. Maybe a jernuk. Whoa! Standing on its hind legs. That looks like something. Gotta build, should... build a water container. And branches. And the red food stalls. There you got the cheeseburger. 
Burgers, the good food, the cheeseburgers, the hot dogs, the sushi, and um, coffee. This is where you can get coffee. And look, some of the picnic tables have disappeared on us too. Which, which is another glitch that my game has. And let's see um, the mandrill. Where's the mandrill? The mandrill is dead. Isn't it? Yeah, I remember the mandrill died. But I hope we'll get some I'll get another mandrill from the animal store. Now they live in the tropical rainforest. There it is. Wash. Always wash your animals. You don't know where they came from. It looks like that. Is that what's that mantrail gonna do? And uh, hey guys, uh, did, did you ever watch any uh, TikTok uh, vines saying that um, convincing you that Scar ate Mufasa? That lion skull can all confirm that Scar ate Mufasa, that was Mufasa's skull, but Scar did not actually eat Mufasa. And that's not a lion skull that Scar was playing with them. Um, playing with in the prism in Pride Rock. He was actually, um, uh, up. This animal skull is a bat. a man. a mandrill skull. So you understand what I'm saying? Scar was actually playing with a mandrill skull instead of a lion skull. And here, oh, what animal was in here again? Pygmy hippopotamus. Where'd that pygmy hippopotamus went? Oh, it died on me too. What's with all these animals dying? Don't I have enough zookeepers? Oh. And now I'm, I'll show you um two savannah an animals. Um, the wildebeest. There's the wildebeest. These will be they need a bath, that's for sure. Some more wire to drink. Oh, a lot of poop. I'm gonna sweep it all up. And give it a nice scoop. And I gotta repellish the grass. And next, the warthog. What is that warthog doing? Maybe something. I think just uh, gonna have some berries. Very hungry. And the two classic zoo tycoon anim animals, where they name, and two of the classic zoo tycoon animals that I find them somewhere. I'm a little map. I'm a little sidetracked from the maps. Oh yes, I'm supposed to go down. There we go. Now. Here are the two classic zoo tycoon animals from Africa. The zebra. Oh, gosh, that zebra's been eating a lot. Maybe that zebra's having some, um, some something going on with their 
bowel movements. Pooping a lot, which is unusual. And I got the elephant. Oh, why do these animals keep pooping? That's just gross. I've hired like a lot enough zookeepers to take care of the job. And I gotta wash this elephant. <laughs> is that why you're taking a bath? Because um, you were, because you didn't like being in a smelly exhibit. Does uh, your wine need cleaning too? Did you poop inside here too? Hope not. Nope, it's pretty good. It's, it's clean. It's safe. I go, that was hay. I walked on. And the grass. Okay, we're almost done. I need to show you my, um, my reindeer, and, uh, I need to show you some other endangered animals. My four other endangered animals. I can find them. I, you've, you've seen the spruce tortoise already. Yeah, there's actually two exhibits containing an African spruce tortoise. And once again, poop. A lot of poop. The rain. Here's our reindeer, aka caribou. Probably thirsty. Don't these zookeepers know when to come to the exhibits? Oh, these irresponsible zookeepers. And look to your right, a little play park. Let's go check that out. Let's have some entertainment for all you kids are. Young adults who look, have a good sense of humor, or like to have fun. A jumpy castle. Jumpy castle. Some uh, teeter totters and the slide. And this and um and some monkey bars. But that's not all. I got two more animals I'm going to show you next. Spectacle bears. I was expecting there was going to be more poop. I think that's probably why some of the animals are dying. Because of all the, the dirty smells. This is why it's important to clean your exhibits. And clean uh, your house. What's that spectacle bear doing? Just going to lie on a heated rock? Hope he jumps off. Oh, I knew that. I just read his mind. He's gonna jump off the rock. Of course. Now here's an, that. That's what. That's the first poop I found uh, underwater. A respectable pair. And last, I'm gonna show you um the pea horse. Where is that little pea horse? Oh my gosh, I forgot to create a gate. Oh, and, and let me guess, there's going to be a lot of poop in this exhibit too. Of course, a lot, a lot. Ooh, I can smell it from the screen. Ooh, I can imagine how it feels like to be inside this horse exhibit. Very dirty and passed out. If I had this job in real life, I would pass out. I'm smelling all that poop. Well, that's um the end of sh the tour of showing you the animals, and now we're gonna go on uh, a lovely cheap ride, a clean cheap ride. Hope that takes your mind off all that poop. As long as you don't see any poop on the way. Which I doubt you, you might see. You might or might not see poop. I can't guarantee anything. Here we are on the Jeep tour.
I told you you'd be seeing some poop, but yeah, there was going to be poop on the Jeep tour. That's right. But, um, hopefully you'll be, uh, high up away from the poop in, um, uh, the next, uh, in, on the Skytram ride. Let's see where we can find the station. Follow the circuits. There it is. There's the station. There's. Looks like there's one coming up. Enjoy the ride. I'm going to remain. Yes. 